Hi guys. Um, long time no see. It's been a minute. Um, I have an unboxing that I want to do, um, but first I just kind of want to say hello. I think the last video that I did was my wardrobe video that was like a year and a half ago back in February I think of last year um I mean a lot of things have happened since February of last year I mean the pandemic was just one thing um I moved I had a bunch of changes in my life I I'm playing with scissors now that I'm going to use to open the box later um but yeah so I just I kind of wanted to use this just as like a little chit chat catch up moment just because I feel like that would be nice. Um, but also I have a box that I uh, am very excited about that just got here today from Paris. So that's fun. Um, yeah, so I guess the first thing I want to say is hello again. Um, I really want to start making videos again just because I have a really cute room um, and like all angles of it are cute too, which is exciting to me because usually I've had like one corner that's nice instead of just like an entire room. So I have kind of an entire room now that I'm really pleased with, which makes me happy. Um, I don't know, I mean, my whole life has just been crazy lately, so just a lot going on. Um, but I am here now, more stable as a person than I think I've ever been in my entire life, um, which makes me excited because now I just, I have a lot of freedom and ability to do a lot of different things that I couldn't really do before. And I'm just kind of excited about life in a way that I haven't been for a while, um, which is kind of inspiring me to come back and do more things like videos and get dressed up a lot more and all kinds of stuff like that. So yeah, I mean, if anybody wants just like a general catch up of like the last year, um, I guess you can ask for that, but it's just, there's been so much. So, but now I am feeling a little more evened out, which is great. Anyways, box. We have a box here. Um, I won't show the front of it, but it is from AP Paris. Now, uh, I have a dress in here that was released recently that I am excited about. And it was one of those dresses that like, I looked at it and was like, I love this. I know other people are not going to love this. Um, there's also something that my friend ordered in here. Um, we ordered together. And so I'll just go ahead and show that too. It's a cute, it's pretty cute. Um, but I guess we'll just get right into it. Uh, I have been pretty excited about this dress. I haven't bought a new release in a while. Am I lying? I don't think I'm lying. I'm pretty sure it's, that's true. I haven't bought a new release in a while. I did buy Toy Doll Box when they did that, like made to order. No, it wasn't made to order. When they did the re-release last couple years ago, whenever that was, I didn't get it till a few months ago, but um, whenever they sent it out, I have no idea sense of time anymore. Hold on, just, just bear with me for a moment. I'll be right back when I get this box open. Okay, we got it. Um, it was a very strange box design that I was struggling with. Um, first off, I wanna say that ordering from AP Paris has been the most streamlined AP ordering experience that I've ever had. Um, it was the easiest. I feel like their site is the easiest to maneuver. Um, to me, it was easier than AP USA. I know AP USA is, you know, useful for a lot of things, but I feel like AP Paris, I just had the easiest personal experience with, even um, in, you know, in comparison to buying from a, like through a, a shipping service, which, or a shopping service, which I've done in the past too, and that works fine. Um, but I just had a really good, streamlined, easy experience with AP Paris, um, which I am excited about. So first up we have this, bag um shopping bag there's something in the bag and i'm not sure if it's my accessory piece so i'm gonna take a little peek in there i think it probably is yes it is so i'll come back to that in a minute when i um get everything else out so first off we have this really cute blouse that my friend ordered um now she's just gonna have to deal with me like showing it i will go ahead and refold it for her <laughs> i'm the worst She'll live. Sorry, Abby. Super cute gingham blouse. Oh, that's actually really adorable. So it's just got lace detailing up here on the sleeve and the collar. I actually really like that this is kind of a, a little peaky skin moment happening right there. I think that's really cute. But this is just a cute little pink gingham blouse with a ruched waistline which I think is really adorable so that's cute I will refold this for my friends because this is not mine but I wanted to show it because it was very cute and something that we um, kind of collectively decided would be a good 
taste for her to have in her wardrobe. She's very into like gingham, over the top, cutesy, kind of almost picnic-y looks with like little aprons and stuff like that. So that is really her style and that was really cute for her to get. Now, the piece that I got was, when I saw this dress announced, I instantly was like, I love it. I love it so much. And it was one of those dresses that I knew other people probably wouldn't like. And I was right. A lot of people do not like this dress. I don't care. I got... <laughs> to edit that out, but I've been breeding up dust all day. I think it's because I just turned my fan on. I got Galaxy Cocktail in pink, the OP. So I am very excited about this. And I'm gonna go ahead and open this up. And now I saw this dress and I have actually been wanting a galaxy print dress for a while, but I just couldn't decide which one I wanted. And then I saw that this one had like martinis on it and um, a star pocket and like a little harness situation happening. And that was kind of everything to me. So here we go. Woo. Okay. Okay, this is a different kind of material than I felt like any AP dresses made out of before. That, that's just my experience. Most of my AP stuff is 10 years old or close to it. Um, so I don't really have a whole lot of newer pieces from them. So this is kind of a different thing for me to do to buy a new piece. Oh, okay. So first up we have the construction up at the top is really neat. I think this was just a really unique cut. I know they've been branching out a lot in their collars and cuts and accessories. So I was pretty excited about this personally. I think it's pretty cool, this collar situation going on at the top. Um, the fabric feels very, it's a lot heavier than I anticipated it being. I kind of expected more of their, what they've been doing lately with that uh, synthetic fabric, which it is, but it's a heavier, it feels a lot heavier. I don't really know how to explain that. Um, the one thing I will say is that I was worried about the material that the harness is made out of, and I was kind of right about it. It is that sort of shiny, I mean, it is shiny um, sort of material, and you can see it might catch easily. So there's like some threads that are kind of already a little bit um, loose, which is, eh, I kind of expected it with the, well, I could tell what kind of material this was made out of, um, but I still really like it. We've got, the little galaxy patch here which is so cute i loved this because i love details like this on dresses that are not um like pieces you have to purchase separately if that makes sense like a, not a patch that you have to buy it's just like a detail on the dress i feel like a lot of times with these kind of dresses they don't really do that so i really loved that and then the ap star on the other side which hopefully you can see i also really love that this bow up here is detachable and then we've got a little star zipper charm just the AP star sticker. Sticker, zipper, can't speak. Um, the entire harness is detachable, which will be helpful. Um, I think it does, it, it's kind of awkward when you're trying to hold it up. Um, but we also have a detachable star pocket down here, which just is a little pocket uh, on the other side. You can just stick things in there. I think this is really cute. I love the star pocket. I know they did something similar with Little Witch that came out during Halloween last year. Um, I know there was like, I don't know if it was a star pocket. It might have been a star pocket, but it's just so cute. And I really loved that they like included that kind of detail on this dress too. Um, I don't know, I just really liked it. And the print, we've got our martinis and our little drankies and our little galaxies. How cute. <laughs> okay, I love this. I've been calling it my space alcohol dress um, pretty much everywhere that I talk about it. I know it's actually called Galaxy Cocktail, but like, it's just so easy to make fun of. I don't know, I love it. We've got the same uh, material as the harness down here on the hem, as well as like a little pink lining on the inside, which is good. I hope I'm centered now. Got a pink lining there. Overall, this is really, really cute. The back of the OP has a little crisscross on it, so a little crisscross detail, which I think is kind of cool. Um, got lots of star buttons and stuff going on there. I'm pretty excited about this. I think it's really cute. Very excited, very excited. Move this box out of the way because it's ugly. Um, and then lastly, I was not able to get the matching socks. 
Um, they sold out pretty quick because they kind of match a lot of things, but I did get the barrette in the matching head bow and matching head and the matching colorway, which is bigger than I anticipated, which makes me happy. So we've got just a matching pink barrette with the same little galaxy boy, galaxy boy, planet. The word I'm looking for is planet. AP planet. I'm suffering. <laughs> uh, I don't have a whole lot of hair, but that's something that will look really cute with a wig uh, that I will have to style. All right. Um, so I am probably going to put this on um, because I am ridiculous and I want it on my body immediately. Um, and then I'll do a little, uh, maybe a little, a little shot. We'll, we'll, we'll show it off a little bit. So I wanted to take a second to just show the dress worn and kind of talk about it for a minute, I guess. I don't really have any accessories or anything with it. I just wanted to put it on. I did not put the bow on because I didn't feel like putting a wig on and it doesn't look right on like, you know, not really, not really a jam. So um, a couple things that I noticed when I put it on, I had the hardest time putting on this dress that I think I've ever had. Um, mostly because this front zipper is very misleading. I thought, oh, front zipper. I'm just gonna undo the front zipper and put it on. No, please don't do that because it doesn't go over the waist. Um, so you're trying to like put you put your put the waistline of the dress over your shoulders, which is difficult. Don't do that. Um, so <laughs> do undo the back zipper. Secondly, um, this needs to be unbuckled before you can put it on. Um, I try. I did that too, and it just it was. Just, I didn't, don't worry about it. I I was over eager and like didn't think about it. The third thing I want to say is I don't know if you can see, but on the back the start button right here is very pointy and i know a lot of their i kind of expected that because a lot of their things have pointy star buttons but the material that this and the collar is made out of actually catches really easy like i mentioned earlier so the, the pointy star button and the easily catching material is kind of a bad combination um and i could already tell that there's going to be a problem with that i'll have to be careful when i'm like buttoning and unbuttoning the neck the other thing is there are no loops uh, that hold this harness in place. Like, it, like it'll just come right off, which is fine. It stays in place pretty okay, but I tend to be really finicky with my clothes. So if it's not like secure, I'm gonna keep like messing with it. And that's, like I said, it's fine. It's just something that I noticed. Other than that, I think the construction is really nice. This is actually one of the nicer pieces I've seen from them recently in terms of construction and weight. Um, I think for me, it's a win, a big, big win um, from AP for me. <laughs> I understand for a lot of people it's not, and that's fine, but I just really enjoy this color and the scheme and the seam work is all excellent, which again is pretty normal for AP, but I feel like a lot of their more recent releases, I am just really pleased with how this feels. And I think it's really cute. Um, I guess if anybody has any specific questions about the dress, um, they can go ahead and just uh, comment. That'll be fine. I can go ahead and answer anything. Um, if anybody wants to see any up close details or anything, you can just get me on Instagram. That's fine too. Um, I'm pretty responsive over there um, for the most part, especially with like important serious questions. I'm pretty good at like, oh, well, I'll help you out with that. Um, so yeah, I'm very happy with it. And I'm, I'm glad you kind of came to hang out with me. Um, I have another dress that I'm pretty excited about that will be coming soon-ish, as well as some Taobao stuff, so if you like unboxings, I'm probably gonna keep doing them. Um, but I do want to make more content, just in general, kind of like different, do different things. I've also been streaming a little bit on Twitch lately, just trying to do things to talk to people. But yeah, I guess if anybody has any suggestions or requests, just let me know and I will see what I can do. Um, anyways, thanks for hanging out with me and I'll uh, catch you later. Bye-bye.